close enough. Well, all right, so it's the next day now. I have since installed the secondary layer there all the way to the back. Just got some uh, makeshift things holding her in there. So the next step now is to kind of tidy up a bit and then we're gonna be putting rhino liner on top of this, uh, well, imitation rhino liner. I mean, let's not get carried away. On the bench top here, gonna be uh, installing some shelf backings on there. So when I push stuff in there, it's not gonna be falling out of the back or nothing, so. Okay, next step here is to, well, actually the next step I've already done, drill a hole for a power bar that's gonna be going there. Uh, and so other than that, I'm gonna have to sand the whole bench, install the shelf backings, a couple coats of the old Rhino liner there, and then uh, organize the garage to make it look presentable. This is all being done, obviously, while the wall dries there. And by wall, I mean uh, protective, whatever that stuff is, vinyl. Thought they only put that on records, but whatever. Learn new stuff every day. Without further ado, let's get her going. All right, so the first coat is on. It's looking pretty good. Uh, it's not looking like a truck bed liner yet, but there's still time. I might have picked up the wrong one. Who knows? There's a lot of ideas floating around right now about maybe doing the bat the bottom down here. Oh, look at that overspray. Eh? Wow, way to go, bud. Oh, it's everywhere. It's just all over the like. Why even use that thing there? Why even use that if you're just gonna spray it on your shelves anyway? That's where I'm at right now. Get back at you when next couple coats are on. All right, so it's the next day again. I put on another two coats on the rig, and it seems to have dried uh, quite nicely. Well, it's not completely dry, but Feels like a truck bed liner. Who would have thought, right? Now it's time to uh, somehow manage to push this back into the wall there. It's got a little gap going, right? Need more space so I can park in here. That's the whole idea. Anyway, I'll get back at you after the tidy up's done. Well, all right. So as you can see, give you the old zoom around. Pretty much got her all done now. Did a big old sweep, big old clean. Lots more storage space. Lots more, uh, well, just doesn't suck, basically. Got myself a Slurpee here. Ah. Uh. Anyway, all that's left to do now, there's a little bit of excess hanging out underneath on the rubbers. Got to cut that off down there. I'm not sure if you can see that right there. Oh, there, oh, there we go. Right there. So got to cut those rubbers off there. I'm just in the process of installing the vise. Drilled some pilot holes there. I think I'm going to not bolt down all the tools. Maybe I will. I was just thinking that if I didn't bolt them down, then there'd be more. I could just put them wherever, right? And then I'd be probably better. Who knows? I like this Rhino liner stuff. Not even Rhino liner, bud. Come on. This spray on cheapy, whatever it's called stuff so much. I think I'm going to spray the toolbox in it. Uh, Cause essentially I got, I bought the one, uh, bought the one, uh, when I got this toolbox there, uh, I came with a bunch of stickers. Uh, I don't know what it, what they're from. So, well, this one, I know I might've put that on there. So uh, I'll get her all cleaned up, get her all looking nice. And then uh, I guess that'll be the final send off for, uh, for this little project here. It turned into a pretty big one. Start off insulating the wall right and then next thing you know you got the drywall up next thing you know you got a new bench next thing you know you got dust everywhere Ugh. paint in the whole place wow 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 Anyway, this is getting off the rails as per usual. Pretty standard. But yeah, I just got to hang some hooks and stuff and then uh, we'll be good to go. All right, so everything is now organized and good to go. The job is done. So let's take a look. Yeah, got that going there. Got that going there. Got that going there. I don't know if I mentioned it, but I uh, got some rhino liner on there. Douchier already. It's not even rhino liner, but come on. Then got the toolbox there. Lock up all the tools. Couple of storage bins up there and that's it. That's the reno for you. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Tune in at some point whenever I feel like making another video, right? Got a backlog of content, right? <sighs> uh, gotta get her going. So anyway, I'll, uh, I'll catch you later. Like, favorite, subscribe. A couple of screws, a couple of two bafers. It's gotta be exact or else the plan fails. Ugh.